Health Minister Dr. Perry Gomez says national health insurance could soon be a reality. The Progressive Liberal Party government wants all Bahamians to receive the same access to health care, regardless of their personal wealth or circumstances. A Blue Ribbon Commission was established in August 2002 to review national health insurance. The committee's 2004 report indicated then that the Bahamas cannot afford to have a national health insurance scheme and would only work through adequate government funding. It is also an anticipated that national health care coverage will cover persons with private insurance plans suffering from pre-existing illnesses, newborn babies and those over 65. Dr. Gomez says he believes the groundwork for the program could be implemented within a year. Of the times will dictate when it happens. Uh, in the meantime, we are going to, to uh, study the old uh, document that was done now eight years ago and so the costing in particular is of importance to us because the estimates of cost and so on is eight years old and so you have to revisit that. Now the government will have to employ the same expert advice from actuaries on the International Labor and World Health Organization and Health Canada. Now whether national health insurance will become a tax or a benefit has yet to be determined. NHI requires everybody to pay. So if the level of unemployment is too high, then that's a barrier, you see, because it requires everybody to participate. And, um, and so we must do some corrections in the economy for us, and particularly with jobs, before we jump into that. Dr. Gomez's comments on national health insurance came during a tour of the Sandilands Rehabilitation Center today. 